how many spikes are acceptable per day? And the answer is, however many meals you eat. That's how many are acceptable, because you're going to get a spike every time you put food in your stomach. The question is, to what extent? The goal is to mitigate that spike as much as possible. If you eat foods that are low in refined carbohydrate, high in fiber, and low in leucine, then you should be able to keep your glucose spike and therefore your insulin spike relatively low. Optimally, you should probably only eat two meals a day, maybe three meals a day if you've got a family and you, know, you need it, but probably two meals a day will do it. We in America tend to eat three and is that part of the reason we have metabolic dysfunction? I don't think so, but some people have postulated that we don't need that third meal. Maybe we don't need that third glucose spike. Hard to know. We don't have good controls to answer the question. Ultimately, I don't care how many spikes you have, as long as you do whatever you can to mitigate the amplitude of the spike and the duration of the plateau. In other words, improve insulin release and improve insulin sensitivity. Get the insulin down any way you can.